Bill After here at the After Chat with WWE Hall of Famer, and he's got a new book out, co-authored with my dear friend and former correspondent, Bertrand Herbert. Did I pronounce that right? Who? Bert, Bert Herbert. Bert Herbert, yeah. Yeah, Bertie Herbert. Bertie Herbert, I whatever you want to call him. Yeah, yeah. So we're here at the 51st annual Cauliflower Alley reunion. I, but tell us what this means to you being here at the Cauliflower Alley. Well, we're just another day in paradise, you know, yeah. being around wrestling. But, you know, last night when I was sitting there with all these people and then for a moment, I mean, I look back since I started writing my book, I'm going back, it's always in my head, and I'm looking at the future, you know, I don't know how many years I'm going to have, you know, being alive. Yeah. It felt like a nice little heaven last night. Yes. Yeah. All these people there that loves wrestling and the wrestlers. And love you. Yeah, you know, yeah. it's beautiful, you know, and it's, that's what it felt. I'm going, I feel like I'm in heaven. Yes. It yeah. just felt. Heaven on earth? Yeah. It's, it's a cliche, you but say that? true. Yeah. Heaven on yeah. earth, yes. Yeah, yeah. And who have you or seen? Heaven, or heaven in the ring. That's, I like that. Not I bad. like that. Yeah, that, that's not bad at all. Tell us about the book. You're going to love the book. I know I will. Everybody. I love everything you do. You know. No, no, the book is going to be good. It's going to be about Pat Patterson. It's going to okay. be about my life, okay? Right. right. It's not that I, I beat this guy and I took the championship. Your no personal days are life. Over. Come on. Your personal I'm a wrestler. Life. I was yeah. a wrestler all my life, and I'm still in love the business very much. But the book, you're going to love it. Guarantee. ECW Press, who also put out published my book, has published this. And when does it hit the... Uh, uh, around August. Okay, and a great ad in the uh, WWE Hall of Fame and WrestleMania oh, yeah. program. It looked absolutely fantastic Good. there. So I know this is an old cliche question, but people always say, Pat, what was the highlight of your career? Is there one moment that stands out that you'd love to go back and do all over again exactly the same way you did it before? Well, you know, I was very successful in San Francisco. I, yes. can, never, I can never forget that. You know, yes. For years and years, 16 years, I was like the guy in San you Francisco. Were? You, were? you know. But too bad that I didn't have a chance to wrestle at WrestleMania. Uh, that was those days that were too yeah, old for me. Yeah. But one thing that stands out a lot for me is that wrestling in the main event at Madison Square Garden. Oh, of course. That's an accomplishment. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so what, what we're going to do now is, you see, Pat is a, uh, a lover of karaoke as I am, so you just cued me on something, so I'll start it. We don't have to do the whole thing, but I left my heart in San Francisco, high on a hill. It calls to me. It calls to me. Ready now, together? To be where little cable cars climb halfway to the sky. The morning fog will chill the air. I don't care. Take it. My, My love waits there. My love waits there. You had enough. Thank you very much. We'll see you at the karaoke bar. <laughs>